Quick update on your Wednesday afternoon on-demand storm tracker forecast. Chief Meteorologist checking in with you at about 1.10 p.m. here on your Wednesday. Area low pressure still driving some showers across the southeast corner of Montana. So if you're traveling in that direction up until midnight tonight, there's still some pockets of often on snow, which may have a minor influence on travel on I-90 heading into northern Wyoming. Watch those bridge decks, for example. They could be a little on the icy side, but there could be some accumulating snow showers there and wind. But the storm system is lifting up into North Dakota. So we're finally rid of it. So it took about four or five days for this thing to really spin through. And as you can see in our true view forecast, a few hit and miss mountain snow showers mainly. Valley floor could get peppered with a little bit of snow from Bozeman eastward. But a lot of this will taper around sunset. And clearing skies overnight should pave the way for some fog in the early morning hours. And definitely a frosty start to your Thursday. Thursday evening, clouds begin to move in. And then here comes another cold front by Friday morning. And again, it's this disorganized precipitation moving through. Hit and miss off and on rain and or snow for the valley floor and some minor snow accumulations are possible at higher elevations but the bigger concern tonight is those clear skies we'll be down to at least freezing at midnight but we may end up in the teens and 20s early tomorrow morning for butte still considerable cloud cover a few snow showers around bozeman but eventually clearing chilly and frosty by early tomorrow morning